What's up guys, it's Larry the Mortgage Guy, sales disruptor, and I'm going to talk about the concept of being hyper local. Now, if you're in marketing, you probably do understand this, that you actually have studied marketing or you are part of a marketing team or you're a CMO of some sort or whatever, then you probably understand the concept. But this lesson or topic is for people who don't understand what hyper local means. Hyper local means you want to focus on the area that you officially work in or do business in. So when you're talking about events, news, when you check in, when you uh, friend people, when you join groups, you want to be hyper local. You want to try to connect with people who are literally in the same zip code as you or in within a you know five mile radius of you. Ten miles could work too, but of course, you know, depending on your market, you're probably already kind of diving into other people's territories and you're gonna have too much competition. Whereas if you can learn to be the guy in your hyper local market, you're going to do a lot better. Uh, so you notice that I actually do my best to uh, talk about local areas. You know, I check into local restaurants and I talk about local things uh, because I'm basically trying to engage with the people who will understand or who will connect. I'm originally from Houston. I have a lot of people from Houston uh, on my friends list, but I don't really talk much about Houston because it's not where I do business. I'm licensed in all of Texas, so I can help anyone, but uh, the way I look at it, I'm better off uh, focusing on my neighborhood and the people in my neighborhood, you know, because those are the people that I'm going to end up interacting with more. I'm going to be able to attend events with them. I'm going to be able to, uh, you know, cross promote or, or whatever with people that are local. So you want to focus on being hyper local when it comes to your marketing and such. I'm not saying don't talk about world events and don't make friends in other cities and other states and yada, yada, yada. I mean, I, trust me, I'm a big fan of that. But if you're going to focus your energy on something, one thing, focus it on being hyper local versus, you know, spreading out as far as possible. Okay. Uh, if you need advice on how to do that, uh, you can always contact me, but it's really easy. You know, check into your local Starbucks, check into your local grocery store, you know, buying milk for the kids or whatever. Uh, having lunch at my favorite Mexican restaurant right down the street, whatever, you know, become that guy that uh, is known for being the the real estate guy or the mortgage guy, or the furniture guy or the car guy in the market in the neighborhood. And if you check into a restaurant and review it, that restaurant will know about you and there's a chance that they actually might share your post. I've done it before where I checked in, in into a restaurant and I talked you know, how, about how great it was and I checked into their page and they shared my post. So now I'm featured on their page, right? So focusing on being hyper-local, focusing on connecting with people in your, your neighborhood is just going to uh, build your market a little bit better and it might even SEO better. Uh, SEO, yeah, SEO better, right? Uh, anyways, hopefully you got some value out of that. If you have any questions, give me a call. This is Larry, the mortgage guy. You're a sales as well. I'm